Got his new wing, his new motor, everything. He's pretty much ready to go. And there he goes, running a charger. Yet. At about six o'clock, and I've just uh, this is the first time back since I've uh, had problems with my motor running really bad and high RPMs. I've run it for about 45 minutes, and I can't duplicate the error. Well, I did duplicate it, fix a couple things. Uh, well, I'm not going to say I fixed a couple things. I changed a couple things. It seems like uh, that might have taken care of it. But uh, we'll go ahead and fly around for a little bit, see how this goes, and see if we can make heads or tails of how things are running. Boy, that wing looks good on David Strike. New poster. It's not smooth as butter. It's pretty. Uh, it's pretty good. Got a few bumpies here and there. But uh, for six o'clock, we came out here a little early. Trips are out to about six. Set at neutral. RPMs are about five thousand, or exactly five thousand. Shout out to Richard Ludwig. Bought me breakfast the other day and gave me a couple pretty cool stickers. A magnetic sticker and another sticker. I'll make sure I get them on this video. I was going to put it on my uh, my uh, mud shield down here, but it's a little bit too big to put there. I could cut it down part of it and put it on there, but uh, we'll definitely get a shot of it. It's pretty cool. Yeah, Richard, uh, he met me down at Cracker Barrel in Cambridge. And he made the mistake of telling me he'd buy breakfast, so I worked the whole place. He was lucky to get out of there with any change in his pocket. David bought his wing from Neil, and Neil's been trying to get down here and fly with us. Yeah, a little bouncy out here. Now he's running, uh, David's running a Charger. 31, and he picked that up from Neil, and Neil ordered him a 34, Charger 2, because Neil said he's all muscle at 270. I want to thank several people out there that uh, helped me out, Errol sent me some uh, floats for my big 84. I appreciate that. And uh, talked with several people that gave me some ideas. It's one of those things where it's a needle in a haystack and uh, you know, you start throwing money at it, you try everything. And it was running, it would run really good till about 15, 20 minutes and it'd just go to crap. 
uh, normally at higher RPMs. And uh, a couple things kind of gave me some clues of when I finally figured it out. Well, once again, I don't know if I figured it out or not yet, so we'll see. We're only been flying for about seven minutes. I hey, this up above me. I would guess that he probably wants to do some touch and goes or some landings and takeoffs just to practice that new wing. Either that or he's just so excited with his new wing and motor he's not coming down. So I'm running Echo Red Armor. And uh, so far it seems to be burning pretty good. First of all, no, till I look at the spark plug. And the last time I looked at the spark plug, which was today, it was burning really clean. But I guess also checking the uh, piston and seeing what kind of carbon buildup and so forth on it would help. Got a pretty good crosswind today. Coming from our right here. Ordered a bunch of uh, carburetor parts, and not really a bunch, just a basic rebuild kit, which was uh, basically some, a few gaskets and a, and a float needle and a couple other things. But anyway, all said done, uh, very basic, basic. Uh, God, I can't, I, I should have taken a picture, maybe I will, but a basic rebuild uh, just getting it to my house was about $140, and it's just a few tiny little parts, and uh, and that did not include the floats. The floats are around $90. I, I think the next time uh, I just buy a whole new car, spend a little bit more and get the whole thing. I don't know why I'm whining. Here comes David. Boy, that thing looks good. Pretty wing. About 280 feet in the air. Not about 29. Wind from the right side. Yeah, I'm glad I put this jacket on. It's a little cool up here. It's been in the 50s, uh, low 50s, in the morning. And uh, really nice sleeping weather. 30 miles an hour, 308 feet in the air. RPMs are about 4,900. So far, things are running well. Oh, there goes an airplane. Where did he come from? I'll have to look at the video to see where he came out of. I don't see any hangers open. I don't know if he's from out of here. Or... So 22 minutes been flying. Got a good tailwind. 